The cool nights and chilly mornings are a good reminder of the changing weather ahead. Right now, Keep Kettle Land Warm is collecting winter coats and apparel so people can stay safe in the cold. And as Kettle Land's Kelly Volk reports, there's another way for you to help the program and the community. Coats and winter apparel aren't the only things you can donate to keep Kettle Land Warm. St. Francis House volunteer coordinator Tom Foster is also looking for five to ten people to donate their time each week for the program. Any group of volunteers I get um, is going to be needed and um, really provide us um, with a great gift of service as well as the community with a great gift of service. Lewis is collecting coats right now and Montgomery's picks them up once a week and drops them off at the St. Francis House. Volunteers will sort the coats and check them over. We'll make sure all the zippers work real well. The coat sorting will happen here at the St. Francis House dining room. Volunteers will come here every Wednesday through the month of October from 3 to 5. It isn't a super difficult thing to do. Um, it's just a little bit of a uh, little bit of time that you it takes to sort them. The St. Francis House is working with different organizations, including the banquet, to get the coats to people in need. It's an essential thing. We live in a very cold part of the country, and so this is an item people can't go without in the wintertime. And whether you're donating outerwear or your time, you're making a difference. In Sioux Falls, Kelly Volk, Kelly Land News. If you'd like to help volunteer, you can call the St. Francis House. There are phone numbers in this story online. And don't forget, through the month of October, you can drop off your new or gently used coats, hats, gloves, and more at any Sioux Falls Lewis, expect, except the one downtown. The St. Francis House will collect until April.